Holy Wire mod here, I'm going to be going over WireChat 1.0, which is a way to get around those long distance communication issues on roleplay servers, and also a way for you to have a little bit more private chats with your friends so admins can't eavesdrop. So let's start by breaking this board to separate these units from the main unit. Um, in front of me I have unit number one, to my left I have unit number two, and to my right I have unit number three. We turn them on by pressing this key, and as you can see all three rooms light up. I'm going to start by pressing E on this keyboard, and as it, you see, it says that Holy has joined unit number one on all three screens. You can start by typing message, but the messages have a max character um, cap of 25. That's because the uppercase W takes the most room, and I can only fit 25 of those on a line. So that's all you get for now. But thankfully, there's 16 lines upwards that you can fill, so you have plenty of room to have fun with this. So let's exit. As you can see, it says player disconnected. And we'll go to unit 2, and I'll say, uh, hello, YouTube. Hello, YouTube. And then we'll go to unit number 3. And if you guys were here, you'd say, hello, holy. Hello, holy. Okay. Awesome. So you know all three of these are communicating with each other. Perfect. That's good. Now I want you to take notice to this online text right here. If I'm to join unit number 1, it'll put my name to the left. If I join unit number two, put me in the middle. And if I join unit number three, it'll put me to the right. This is so you have an idea of who's at what unit and who you're talking to. But what about all this mess on the screen? Well, luckily, as the owner, you have chat commands. You tap, uh, type slash CMD. And in your chat box to the left, you get a nice command list. One of them being slash clear. So let's type slash CLR. As you can see, it gets rid of all the text on the screen. Um, the next one that you can do is slash name. And you can name your chat room anything you want here. I'll put it as Holy's Chat. As you can see up top there, it now says Holy's Chat. And in addition, let's uh, get that command list up again, you can kick and mute and unmute players. So I'm going to start by kicking myself. As you can see, Holy has been kicked, player disconnected. Oh no, they hate me. Well, you can also mute players if they keep coming back after you kick them, and they won't leave you alone. So let's go over here, because you can't actually mute yourself as the owner. And that's for good reason. See, if I try to mute myself, it says error, Holy cannot be muted. So let's go over here, and I modified the code to where it will allow me to mute myself, so you can see what it looks like. So I'll type... Let's turn it on first. I'll type mute one, indicating me, and it says to the left in my text box, holy has been added to the mute list. So when I try to type anything, it'll say, you have been muted. If I switch units, you have been muted. Now, you can undo this, but um, I can't actually unmute myself with this unit because I can't type, so I modify this unit to where I can show you how to unmute myself. So let's start by turning it on. And I'll type mute one, indicate mute myself. So as you can see on these other units, you have been muted, you have been muted. On here, it lets me type because I modified it. So I type slash unmute and one, indicating me again. And it says holy has been unmuted in the text box to the left. And now as you can see, yay, I'm free to type. Blah, 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 blah. And that pretty much concludes everything about this, except for one more thing. And that is this uh, metal backing for these units right here is actually breakable. I did that to add a little bit of realism to it in case you needed that for something. You can get around that by getting the unbreakable tool and whack away at it. But otherwise, it will get destroyed and go into oblivion. So uh, I hope you enjoy it. If you have any suggestions, I'd definitely like to hear it. And I'll see you guys later.